ever wondered what's silently affecting your car's performance? Buckle up because we're about to unveil the answer in our latest video, Detecting Trouble, 5 Telltale Signs of a Faulty Oxygen Sensor, or O2. Welcome back to Car Computer Exchange, where we're all about unraveling the mysteries under the hood of your four-wheeled companion. Today, we're diving into the world of cheap, fun, and reliable wheels. You guessed it, we're talking about your trusty ride, your daily commuter, your adventure partner, your car. But hold on to your lug nuts because today's topic is hotter than a revved up engine on a summer day. We're shining a spotlight on an unsung hero lurking in your car's exhaust system, the oxygen sensor. Trust us, this little champion may not wear a cape, but it's got the power to make your car run like a dream, or, well, a clunker. Now, let's talk real talk. You know that annoying moment when your check engine light decides to light up like a Christmas tree? Yeah. We've all been there, and sometimes it's about as helpful as a broken lug wrench. But here's the kicker, a misbehaving oxygen sensor might be the culprit, and it won't always play nice with that flashy dashboard light. So, while we're not promising to turn you into a car whisperer overnight, we've got your back with some insider knowledge. We'll help you decipher those sneaky signs that your oxygen sensor might be giving you even when the check engine light is snoozing on the job. Oxygen Sensor Function Alright, let's kick things off with some car tech wizardry. Picture this, since the vibrant era of the 80s, cars have been quietly equipped with a genius gadget known as the oxygen sensor. This unassuming hero's job is to be the car's taste tester, analyzing the exhaust gases coming out of your engine. It's like your car's internal food critic, but instead of flavors, it's checking for the right mix of oxygen. Why is this important? Well, this sensor's findings are the secret sauce that helps your car's brain, aka the ECU, whip up the perfect air-fuel mixture for the optimal performance. You can think of it as a chef constantly adjusting the recipe to ensure your car is running at its flavorful best. And guess what? This magic happens right in the exhaust pipe, or sometimes on the exhaust manifold itself. This sensor, known as the Oxygen Sensor or O2 sensor, measures the amount of oxygen present in the exhaust gases. By monitoring the oxygen levels, the ECU can determine if the air-fuel mixture is too rich, too much fuel, or too lean, too little fuel. It then makes real-time adjustments to optimize combustion efficiency and reduce harmful emissions. Location of the Oxygen Sensor Now, where does this behind-the-scenes chef hang out? Most cars have this diligent sensor right near the engine, sniffing out those exhaust fumes like a bloodhound chasing a scent. And just when you thought one sensor was enough, enter the downstream oxygen sensor. This sidekick is typically found behind a catalytic converter, playing cleanup crew after the initial analysis. Feeling like your car is playing hide and seek with you? No worries, we've all been there. If you're scratching your head trying to locate these stealthy sensors, consider giving our mechanic-based community forum a visit. We're all about helping you uncover the car's best-kept secrets. Whether you're a seasoned car enthusiast or a novice, our community forum is the perfect place to ask questions and learn from experienced mechanics. Don't let the hidden nature of these sensors intimidate you. Our community is here to guide you every step of the way. Hey there, fellow car enthusiasts! I hope you're still buckled up for this exciting ride through the world of oxygen sensors. But before we dive back into the action, let me ask you this. Have you ever caught your car red-handed, trying to keep secrets from you? Well, stay tuned because we're about to unleash some more detective skills and reveal the hidden signs of a sneaky oxygen sensor. Ready to keep decoding the mysteries under your hood? Let's roll! Symptoms of a bad oxygen sensor now, let's decode the mysterious signals your car might be sending your way. First up, the notorious check engine light. It's like the car's version of throwing shade. But in reality, it's the oxygen sensor giving a heads up that something might be off. However, it's not always a giveaway. Sometimes, this sensor plays it cool, keeping the codes hush-hush. Next, let's talk fuel economy. Or should we say, uh-oh economy. A finicky oxygen sensor can mess with your gas mileage, making your car guzzle gas like a bottomless smoothie. And speaking of exhaust, 
Have you ever witnessed your car blowing black smoke like it's auditioning for a steam locomotive role? Yep, that's your oxygen sensor hitting a glitch in the matrix. But wait, there is more. If your car starts acting like a drama queen with rough idling, hesitating, or even throwing engine misfires into the mix, guess who might be pulling the strings? You got it, that cheeky oxygen sensor. Oh, and if your car fails an emission test, don't just blame the smog. A wonky oxygen sensor could be hiding in the shadows, causing an unbalanced air fuel mixture. This small but mighty sensor plays a crucial role in monitoring the amount of oxygen in your car's exhaust gases. When it malfunctions, it can disrupt the engine's performance and lead to a variety of issues. So next time your car starts acting up, don't forget to give that mischievous oxygen sensor a second thought. Causes of Oxygen Sensor Failure Here's the scoop on these sensors. They're like the Mariah Carey of car parts, built to last a long time but with some quirks. While they can withstand a lot, factors like unburned fuel, your driving style, are you a gentle cruiser or a pedal to the metal speedster? And even the quality of fuel can mess with their mojo. Oh, and using lower quality fuel is like serving your car a sad microwave dinner. It won't be happy. Ever heard of a car burning oil like a candle at both ends? Well, that oil can create a slick mess on your oxygen sensor, throwing off its game. And guess what? Even with a sensor spot A, the issue won't be resolved until you address the oil guzzling culprit. And just like plants need care, your car does too. Skipping maintenance is like ignoring your pet plant. It might not die, but it won't thrive. Neglected cars can make oxygen sensors throw a tantrum, among other things. How to fix malfunctioning oxygen sensors Let's say you caught the oxygen sensor red-handed, playing tricks on your car. What's the plan of action? First, detective mode. Check those wires and connectors. Sometimes, it's just a case of loose connections causing all the chaos. Got a downstream sensor that's feeling a little gunked up? Try this neat trick. Give it a gasoline soap, like a mini spa session. Just remember, no spa day for the upstream sensor. It's like sending your fancy clothes through the wash. Not a great idea. And here's the golden rule. If your upstream sensor is giving you a lift, just replace it. It's like hiring a new chef when the old one just can't get the flavors right. Trust us, this is the most reliable solution to keeping your car's culinary skills in check. Alright, there you have it. Your crash course in deciphering your car's secret messages via its oxygen sensors. Remember, your car is not just a ride. It's a partner in crime. So, keep those sensors in check and keep cruising smoothly. And hey, if you're enjoying these car tales, hit that subscribe button. We've got plenty more where that came from. It's time to keep the rubber burning and the knowledge flowing. And there you have it. The top secret scoop on our car's mysterious oxygen sensor. From check engine light capers to fuel economy drama, we've unraveled it all. But hey, this is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to mastering your car's secrets. If you've enjoyed this wild ride through the world of oxygen sensors and you're hungry for more car wisdom, don't be a stranger. Hit that subscribe button and join our community of car aficionados. We're always here to decode the enigmas under your hood and keep your car cruising smoothly. So until next time, keep those engines purring and those sensors soaring. Stay revved up and informed.